Assalamu alaikum beautiful people we are back with another video and in this video we will talk about how we can get free one or three rated cards in the anniversary event and what are the important things which you have to do in order to get the maximum rewards from the anniversary event so watch this video till the end and don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel we will talk about the event flow how anniversary event looks like what will be the sections of anniversary events and from where we will get the free one of three of your players so you have to avoid this video without sp uh, skipping a single second because it will benefit you in the anniversary event. So, uh, first, let me know how much coins or how much gems you have right now. So, I will see like either they will benefit you in the anniversary event or not. I will try to reply all of you. So, drop your uh, coins and gems in the comment section. So, let's start it with the anniversary event flow first. So anniversary event have five different sections and it will start with the intro section and in the intro there are subsections. The first one will be anniversary challenge. Uh, probably uh, there will be some challenges available like skill games or matches which we have to complete and they will give us anniversary points or anniversary tokens or anniversary tickets. Uh, depends upon the name of those uh, currency. The second one will be anniversary quest, uh, just like every event like Retro Stars event or Hall of Legends events, we get uh, daily or weekly or monthly quests. So these quests will be available in the anniversary event as well, which will give us anniversary points and we will also uh, get some free players, coins and gems. The third section will be join founders uh, and there will be founders exchange. If you remember a previous founders event uh, in the FIFA mobile and these founder sections are coming in the anniversary event as well but don't worry this time there will be no reset uh, in the founders event in order to become a founder we have to do exchange i think that exchange will be really easy so don't worry about it and whenever we will complete that exchange uh, there will be special thanks unlocks after becoming a founder so whenever we will do that exchange there will be special thanks gifts as well if you remember previous uh, founders event in that uh, we had to click on the founder section and then we got some rewards and uh, the amount of people who became the founders were directly proportional to the rewards and i think we got a one uh emote in that and there was also a founder event for free for us so i think we will get a uh, really good players here as well after that there will be top exchanges right now we don't know what are the top exchanges but probably there will be 94 to 103 or maximum let's just say 96 to 103 in the anniversary event it will be similar to the other events exchanges and the last one will be best offers uh, probably there will be some discounted offers like right now if we are opening any pack with uh, let's just say uh, 3000 gems in the next event probably we will be able to open it with 2500 gems this is just my guess or uh, the best offers will be like we have to convert our uh, retro tickets into the anniversary ticket so this is the all about the first intro section we talked about challenges quest uh founders events special thanks exchanges and best offers now let's move towards the second chapter which is a main and in the main there will be season parade uh, i think in the season parade uh, they will may maybe show the highlights of all the season uh, in which we will get a season review which is the second section and the last one is milestone so i think with the points which we will get from the intro section then we have to spend them on this milestone section in which all the plays will be available uh probably there will be an 100 to 1 of the ovr plays available as well so main chapter will be the main thing the third one will be rewards and here we will get all the rewards first one is slash ads and store there will be some ads available which will give some rewards and after that there will be store offers available as well and we have to click them and it will take us directly to the rewards but those rewards uh, will depend upon your fc points and gems so that's not for the f2ps and then there will be mini games as well and we have to complete them probably there will be there will be challenges like some matches we have to complete them and then we will get some reward and the third one this one is important it is the milestone section and uh, here we will get another milestone first milestone was available in the main section and here we will get another milestone so as you remember in the retro events there are two milestones one is in which we are going to get 99 stochiko and the second milestone is in which we will get a 100 ovr player uh so here i think it will be similar to that probably in the milestone first there will be a s2p rewards like probably a one or two 
or let's just say let's increase our expectation directly 103 ovr player for free and in the second milestone it will be luck dependent like 100 to 103 ovr milestone and we have it will be a luck dependent like some of us will get 100 some of us will 101 102 and some of us will be really lucky and they will get 103 so this was the reward section the fourth one this one is the biggest one flash sale will be available alongside uh, anniversary event probably it will be available on the first day or in the first uh, week like after two or three days and in the flash sale it will refresh three times per day so i think it will refresh after every eight hours and the second one will be daily rewards probably these daily rewards will be some coins gems don't increase your expectation after that there will be flash sale rewards as well uh, probably they will be free to play for us and this thing this is looking p2p for me it's a milestone and for example if i will spend 500 fc points i will get one milestone then if i will spend 2000 fc points i will get second milestone on the third milestone i have to spend 5000 fc points and whenever i will get spend 10000 fc points i will get the last milestone so these milestone i think probably will give us free players like the first uh, 500 fc points this will be a 96 let's just say to 103 the second one will be 98 to 103 the third one will be 100 to 103 and i think in the last it will be 101 to 103 or a free 103 ovr player but after spending 10000 fc points which will be a lot i think rk reddy will only get this one so after that there will be chapter 5 which is a gallery in the gallery there will be daily bonus uh, we will get rewards daily probably this will be equal to the login rewards the second one is featured players Uh, the third one is icon in the featured players all the event players will be available let's just say those who will be given by fc mobile all the players who uh, haven't got any higher ovr players now they will get the card then there will be icons as well and they will be decided by the fc mobile we don't have any say in this the uh, next one will be heroes alongside icons there will be heroes cards prodigies prodigies i think uh, all the young players uh, which are making some exceptional games or which are or who are making their names right now in the football they will be available as well in the gallery and the last one is top transfers those players who got into the new club like uh, uh, Kylian Mbappe Julian Alvarez then uh, Mathias Delit and on the other uh, transfers players then this section will be available for them as well but i think in the gallery only gallery will be available or probably some milestone will be available like we have to get this player and then that gallery section will be take something like that uh, if you remember as you element you know what was available in the gallery event so these are the five different chapters of the anniversary event and for, for and it's looking like it will be a long event and it will be complex as well i think it's worth it because now uh, we have to spend some time in the fc mobile and now let's talk about what are the important things which you have to do first uh, don't waste your coins right now sell your squad because you need you will need a lot of coins to get one or three or one or two ovr players for the squad upgrade second you have to get a lot of gems because there will be daily uh, flash sales 99 to 1 or 3 so you have to try your luck on th- those uh, packs because most of the time if you will be lucky you can pack a one or three ovr players then if you are spending your fc points on the packs i will suggest you to hold them for the few weeks right now i will suggest you to complete the gems offers or complete the quests or complete the event which are giving uh, gems for free because they will help you i already made a video in which i told you how to get uh, 35000 gems uh, in the fc mobile you can watch that video as well uh, if you will complete all the quests if you will complete all the events you will get 35000 gems in the one month so uh, there is another information as well in the flash reward this this is given by artimi uh, anniversary chapter 4 these are the rewards if i uh, as i have told you that in the uh, flash sale chapter there will be daily rewards as well and there, there will be flash sale rewards so these are some rewards 65 to 74 10 times 96 plus player 98 plus player 99 plus player and 100 plus player and also 101 plus player so i think these are the milestone uh, which 500 fc points milestone then there is 2000 fc points milestone the third one 98 plus is i think 2000 fc points milestone and if we will spend 5000 we will get a free 100 plus ovr player and if we will spend 
10,000 FC points, you will get a 101 plus OVR player. So it, it's really huge and I think only P2P will open it. And uh, our team also said that event will start on the 24th September. Some of these rewards are scheduled on the 25th September and some on 28th September. But uh, it all subject to change, not 100% info. So all the rewards will be no will not be available on the first day. Some of those rewards will unlock on the next day. And uh, I will suggest you to get some retro tickets, star pass points and universal tokens. So whenever the new event will be available, you can convert them into the anniversary event points. And uh, do, uh, right now, don't do the exchanges or don't buy any players from the market because in the flash sale event, uh, a lot of people will get the tradable rewards and they will sell those players and then there will be market pick uh, exchanges as well, which will cause a huge market crash. And because of the huge market crash, every player price will decrease. And at that time, you can buy the players and at that time, you can do the investment. So right now, get a lot of coins, get a lot of gems and be ready for the best and the first event of the FC Mobile. I hope this video will be amazing for you guys. We will meet you soon. Till then, bye. Allah Hafiz.